Stay with me now, guys. Dolmar. Check it out, that's what we were able to accomplish. Here's our wood pile. We've been working on this one for a while. It keeps the compression. Check it out. It used to be almost 20 feet tall. I measured it once, it's 22 feet tall. It was 28 feet. Well, it looks about seven now. So yeah. So, we're out of fuel as you can see. And we got all this. Back to the fence line. It used to be grass. We're gonna try to get it back to grass. And you got some trees. You think this thing will handle a tree or two? Can't wait to find out. So I'd like to take a second to thank Makita for purchasing Dolmar. For those of you guys who don't know, Dolmar is the best. Dolmar is the best. Don't take any damn substitutions. Go out and find yourself something that says Dolmar. Why am I saying this? This is a 12 point something featherweight, 12 pound machine. Go find another machine that does what this does. Tell me how much it weighs. I did a bunch of research. This thing weighs 12 pounds. Still, who likes still out there? I love still myself. They make great tools, but do you know how much a comparable machine of theirs weighs? Furthermore, do you know how much that thing costs? Right? I think I remember 48 pounds was the lightest one that would handle something this could do. 48 pounds. This is 12. Remember now, Dolmar. Stay with me, guys. Makita, thank you for representing, building great tools. I am. Um, I'm not always a fan of Makita. I'm a huge fan of Dolmar. I'm a huge fan of Makita for buying Dolmar. But, just because the, um, it says Makita doesn't mean I'm going to buy it. As you can see, here's my other Joy. It's a Milwaukee. Most of my tools are Milwaukee. And they do the job. They do the job. Check them out. 